Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are talking about skincare. Yay! So I'm going to be talking about a product that helps to fight hyperpigmentation, acne scars and uneven skin tone. But before we get into any of that, if you're new here, welcome. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. My name is Teshna. I upload videos every Thursday on hair, fashion, beauty and a little bit of randomness here and there. So please consider subscribing and hit the notification bell just below just so you can keep up to date with my weekly videos. Alright, so let's just jump straight into this review. So a company called Gleamin contacted me and asked me to try out their vitamin C clay mask which is just a mask right here and obviously you know you girls always looking for products that's really going to help give them that popping skin because you know we all want nice skin I know I do anyway so of course I really wanted to try out this mask and give you guys my thoughts so two of the things a couple of things that they claim to do before I jump any further they claim to really give you that instant luminous skin and you achieve that radiant glow as well and it helps with uneven skin tone which is always a plus because you know I'm always looking for stuff that's really going to help with my uneven you know uneven skin tone and lastly they do say that this is formulated for all skin types so if you have dry skin oily skin it doesn't really matter it's for everybody and a bonus is it doesn't stain two things that really popped out to me actually is the is the ingredient so the first thing on here says um vitamin c clay mask with turmeric and aloe vera and when i saw that i was like oh this this has to be good because y'all know there's so much benefits for aloe vera and turmeric like turmeric is anti everything anti-inflammatory antibacterial antiseptic which you know it helps to prevent you know bacteria from spreading especially if you have acne which is always a bonus because you know you don't want to be waking up and you have one people there and then before you know it, at the end of the day you have another one over here that used to happen to me all the time. So annoying. I feel like they really put a lot of thought into the packaging. One of the best things, it comes with an applicator brush. And I love the fact that it comes with this because, I don't know, just, just sometimes I don't like getting my hands dirty. Like, you know what I mean? Like, especially if you have nails and products in your nail. Oh, it's just it's just too much so i must mention that this product is sourced and made in australia and they do ship international i think it also retails for 39.99 but anyways we're gonna get into this application now because i feel like i've been talking way too much Ooh. actually smells all right you know i like the smell it's not too overpowering it's not too uh it's not too much now when it comes to face masks one of my always like my worries is that they always like dry dry up my skin like for example when i had like the bentonite clay i think i did a video on that ages ago and you know the apple cider vinegar that for me is really drying like i had to stop doing that after a while because it was too, it was too much my skin my skin will start to burn a little bit so i'm hoping i don't get any of that the feeling with this it's nice and soothing on my face actually it's really nice and cool Normally I'll do this in my bathroom, so I have a little tiny mirror that I'm trying to look down on. Okay, so it's definitely starting to tingle a lot more now. I can definitely feel it, especially around my, my lip sort of area. It, it kind of tingles a lot more there than anywhere else. So I'm, right, I'm going to leave this on for 10 minutes. Okay, so that's 10 minutes. <laughs> I feel like a ghost. <laughs> so it's not too pulling. You can tell that it's pulling. It did tingle a little bit, but it's not too pulling. It's not too drying. Uh, this is what I like about it. It's not too... Because sometimes some face marks just leave my face feeling too stiff, like, and it feels uncomfortable. This is fine. All right, so I'm going to wash it off now and then come back and show you if my skin is instantly luminous. <laughs> All right, so my face feels oddly moisturized, which is very strange. I don't know if I have that instant glow or illuminous glow. I don't know, guys. What do you What do you think? Do I Do I have that instant glow? Hmm? I feel like with everything, it takes time to see results. Like you need to be using a product consistently for a few, you know, weeks or months to see the difference. So that's what I'm going to be doing, like an updated video in one month from now, because I'm going to be showing you guys my full updated skincare routine and i obviously have this before and after picture so you can see for yourself what the difference is but honestly what i really love about this product is there's a few things i like about it actually love the ingredients like those like 
favorite hands down ingredients definitely and it doesn't leave my skin feeling itchy or dry you know sometimes you get that like itchy feeling then guys if you haven't checked out this product yet please do just check them out gleaming i'll have all the information in the description box i feel like it's a must try and i can't wait to show you my results in one month's time and let me know in the comment section if you've used this product already or if you do any like diy turmeric and aloe vera things at home i would love to know what your skincare routine is like and yeah as usual thank you so much for watching and if you haven't subscribed or hit the thumbs up button please thumbs up this video and i'll catch you in my next one Mwah. bye